make you a part of the Long Island International Film Expo? Well, I was very pleased of being selected for this uh, festival, the Long Island Film Festival. And um, I'm coming from South America for this event, so I'm very excited. In, in an hour, I'm going to see a, a short film in the theater of the Long Island Film Festival, and that for me is just a huge uh, motivation coming from South America and being able to show my film in the United States is like a great gift that makes me want to continue this career of filmmaking. Um, where did you shoot it? I shot it in Asuncion, that's the capital of Paraguay, and some cities around, but it's been all shot in Paraguay, and um, all the actors, all the crew is from my country. I, I studied here in UCLA and in the New York Film Academy also, and um, well, I wanted to shoot it in my country where I was born and show a little bit of my country to the world. Um, so talk about your film. Well, my, my film, The Fuego, is basically about uh, a young photographer that's uh, been working late and he wakes up and he wants to smoke a cigarette, so he needs a light and he doesn't have light in his apartment. So he goes to his neighbor and asks her for a light and she doesn't have it, but she asks him a favor. And from there on, he gets in a chaotic chain of uh, uncontrollable favors that people start to ask him and he never finds light and no one gives him light, but the tragedy and the comedy of being in the wrong place at the wrong time is what moves the story. So. Basically, me as a director, I, I wrote it thinking in my film direction because I didn't have a script, so I it's my first time writing the script. But underneath that uh, tragic comedy story of a young man wanting to smoke a cigarette, really there's a, a subtext that's uh, no one ever gives him a chance to say who he is, what he thinks, how he really is. So people just misjudge him. and. That misjudgment takes him in further and further away from his house and even making him have a very bad time. So what I'm trying to say with the film is give people a chance to know them better before you make an opinion of them. And that's uh, that I think in our modern world we're too externally important to details. Like we should, uh, we're too superficial in our analysis. And that's a way to say it. With comedy, you know, I, I just don't want to do stories that are too, uh, I don't know, uh, talk about, make it critic, but making it very like um, uh, a moral session, you know, I don't want a moral session. I want to entertain people, but also uh, teach a lesson, but through entertainment and through comedy. Um, how did you finance your film? I did it all by myself. This is my first short film, and in my, co in my country we don't have a tradition of film, so not even the government, there's no companies that could finance my film. So I needed to go on with my career, so I did it all by myself. It took me 15 months of work. Yes. Um, so do you have a distribution deal? No, no, uh, I don't. And really the objective of my film was to be able to be in places like the Long Island Film Festival. For me, this is very important because I'm learning. It's just a learning process. Um, and festival, uh, going to festivals is a way to just start to reach uh, maybe producers, executive producers, because of what I want to do with my life is direct films, tell stories. I'm not such in the business side of it, you know. But I need executive producers to think about the business end. And I'm serious enough to know that uh, there's money involved. So being able on the production side helped me a lot to know what time is. Time is money and the resource is money. Um, so it's all a, a learning experience and I'm just enjoying it a lot. Um, so do you have any plans for the future? Future projects? Yes, I, I do actually. I'm I'm writing some short new films and also a long film. 
and depending on how I go around with festivals and uh, now I'm, I, I do need to, uh, to lift up some resources. So I've been in, in, in the Fuego has been sh shown in the Philadelphia Independent Film Festival in Washington, in Chicago, uh, in Thailand this month and next month in South Africa. So all of these places are just teaching me so much and besides I'm getting to know people and see what other young filmmakers are doing. So it's just a wonderful experience. Thank you. Thank you.